shares the story for Youth Month. South Africa's missing children statistics have not been updated since 2013. This is a worrying situation considering how communities are up in arms over suspected child abductions, some even resulting in the deaths of innocent people. In 2013, police estimated at least one child is reported missing every five hours in South Africa. Spello Werner spoke to the National Coordinator of Missing Children South Africa. Let's have a look. So we've got a massive problem in South Africa of our children going missing due to various reasons. So we've seen an increase in kidnappings that are happening. Um, we've got various types of kidnappings that happen, such as parental abductions, opportunistic kidnappings, kidnappings for ransom. And then also we've seen an increase in human trafficking in South Africa that has become a ma massive problem, not just for our children, but for our adults too. With the lack of true statistics, Missing Children SA treats each case as priority as chances of missing persons never being found may increase with time wasted. Unfortunately, we don't have latest stats. The last stats that were put out was from 2013 by the Missing Persons Bureau of South Africa, and that was then, back then, one child going missing every five hours. But we as an organization, you know, we deal with many cases that get reported to us monthly, and we have definitely seen an increase in cases, you know, yearly getting reported to our organization. So that is worse. Well, you know, the... The awareness created around a missing child, you know, needs to be all over so everybody can see it, everybody, the communities can stand together and help us as an organization to find the child as safely and as quickly as possible. And that's also where it comes into reporting a child. When a, reporting a child as missing, you know, you need to report it immediately so action can be taken immediately. Absolutely no waiting period in reporting a person or a child as missing. So it needs to report it immediately as the first 24 hours to 48 hours is crucial when a child goes missing. With that time being lapsed after that 48 hours, a child could be anywhere in the world by then should they have fallen victim to human trafficking. As crimes of kidnapping and human trafficking rising, Missing Children South Africa appeals to everyone to be vigilant and attentive. Yes, we've got a 24-hour emergency number, but please note this number is only for emergencies only. It's 072-647-7464. And then also we've got a website with some wonderful safety tips, how to report a child that's missing. Also, we've got um, an online link that you can report your child or a person as missing on our website. It's www.missingchildren.org.za. Anyone that would like to support our organization by becoming a monthly sponsor or donating to our organization, click on that donate button, be our superhero and help us make a difference in South Africa by bringing a child home safely. Perfect. <laughs> Out-of-home advertising company Tractor Outdoor has offered its network of digital billboards to missing children South Africa at no charge. The new partnership will allow missing children alerts to be uploaded speedily digitally in, or to digital screens in key areas such as petrol stations and high traffic areas across the country. The need for immediate uh, attention is warranted especially where, where time is concerned. Tractor Outdoors Remy Dupree's explains. Advertising company Tractor Outdoors' partnership with missing children is designed to facilitate fast-to-market communication close to areas where the child in question was last seen. So our, our evolution as a business actually started a few years ago, especially around community work. Um, during our period of, of COVID, we, we, we felt the need to actually help out um, other businesses and sort of spurred on an entire journey for us to become a benefit oriented corporation where we we're a business that actually is more profit for purpose as opposed to just profit for stakeholders. So that's sort of the evolution of our business of thinking of how can we use our mass network of digital billboards to improve and bring awareness to, to initiatives that will really need it. Um, beginning of this year we started being a little bit more focused on our strategy on how we can help communities and we've seen a lot of success in other countries of how uh, national billboard operators were actually uh, using their networks to help missing children within those uh, regions. So that sort of spurred on our, our ambition to help out missing children in South Africa.
A national network of, of billboards. Uh, we have just over 200 locations across the country, with most of them actually being uh, in the Gauteng province, uh, followed by Western Cape, uh, KZN, a couple of billboards up in the Eastern Cape, East London, um, and then also a few in Limpopo, North West. Uh, but I must say, uh, we've only been running this initiative for a very short period of time, and uh, we've actually we've had a couple of competitors reaching out to us also uh, requesting to be part of the initiative. So I'm really, really excited that we've been able to spur on uh, interest from you know, competitive businesses to uh, make their inventory available to missing children. With the help of technology, information on the missing person will be able to reach hundreds of thousands of people in the same time as it takes you to upload a Facebook post. It is pretty much as fast as Facebook. Uh, so we get notifications from uh, Bianca. Uh, every single day she will notify us of a, of a child that's gone missing. And uh, because we can put that information into our system and immediately tell our system to, to broadcast the billboards where the, where the person was last seen, it's two minutes, three minutes, a minute. It's, it's, it's very, very, very fast uh, from the time we push the communication out to when it's actually seen on the ground. We are so grateful for Tractor to partner with us as an organization to give us their billboards to use to get the awareness out there of a child that's gone missing. The reaction time also, you know, to get that child's face out there in the, co in the community, in that area where they've just gone missing. It's absolutely wonderful. So more awareness can be created. The more people see it, the more people can contact us with information should they see the child. And the turnaround time when a child goes missing, hopefully can bring that closer and, you know, find the child quicker. So we are very grateful for Tractor to partner with us and we're looking forward to a wonderful future with them. For Cape Town Daily. I am Sipelo Vena. A group of protesters working in the clothing industry protested outside their employer's